What is going on guys? Chris Rednick here and yesterday it was like bittersweet. I had a great day but I also had an awful day. So we're going to rewind a little bit. Last time I was in Connecticut I went to the doctors for my ankle and we did some x-rays and stuff. He checked it out and he pretty much said that the pain that I felt I'm pretty much going to be feeling that for the rest of my life which kind of sucked to hear but he also said that he was like try the activities that you want to try if it hurts too much like make a pros and cons list if it hurts too much put it in the negative list if it if it doesn't hurt then you can continue to do it but he says I have pretty severe arthritis and stuff yesterday we went to Brownstone Park and I thought it was a good idea to cliff jump I didn't think it was gonna be that bad on my ankle. I don't know why, but the pre dude, we jumped off. What do you think? That was like a 60 foot cliff. Yeah, it's probably a 60 foot cliff, and it destroyed my ankle. Like I actually can barely even walk now, and it's it sucks. It's very upsetting, and also it broke my Apple Watch as well. And I'm a huge Apple butt hurt. Like I need this watch, especially because we're working out all the time and stuff. It's like. I need this thing. It's it's a part of me now. So thank God I got some Apple care. We're gonna go into Apple real quick. Start at the day, but oh, it sucks. I'm back to Limpy McGee. Oh well, we're moving on further. This is how I have to walk now. We're back to Limpy McGee. God damn it, I'm pissed. How much of an idiot do I look like right now? You look fine. I think you're being harsh on yourself. He's just being nice. You're walking too fast. <laughs> Weirdest thing ever, right? Yeah. Is it taking all my money? Dude. 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 What was that? I think it took six dollars. I'm just trying to win my brother a Simba. Dude lost six bucks. I think I did, for real. Aw, uh, it was a little too. No? Why is the clock? The claw's not strong enough. No, Six dollars. Literally just got robbed online. That was robbery, no? That was straight robbery. It was filmed. Dude, that's a good grab. That's a good grab. Ooh, that's snaking through. No, that's a grab, dude. <gasps> I'm about to knock this machine out. Dude. Are you kidding me? That was robbery. That was straight robbery. That was perfect. You couldn't go on more perfect than that. It went up. Yeah, go for it, send it. Of course it moved like that. <gasps> hold on, hold on, hold on. We Dude. got it. We got it, boys. Six bucks. In fairness, I should have probably got it three dollars ago. Yeah. I like the music. How's your ankle doing? It's pretty good. It's better now. Uh, Did you think we were gonna win anything? No, absolutely not. I thought you just got robbed. <laughs> this is sick. All right, let's go eat pizza. How many? How much money is it gonna take this time? See, this is why I can't gamble. I can never just take the win. See it? Oh. Dude, 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 stop it. Stop. Whoa, 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 wait, what? How do you stop it? You can't! Bro. Bro, it took ten dollars. <laughs> oh, you better get a fucking Sonic This is toy. ridiculous. It took ten dollars and I only got six credits. Seven, because you're playing. Oh, seven, great. Yeah. That's it. That's the one. That's the Yup. Oh, what? Dude, it almost bounced. I'm, I'm a bad gambler. I have problems. You can get him this time. His face is right there. I know. He just has to fuck in. Send her home. Oh, I, I was hoping that... I was hoping the claw would go around my head and it's... Why do you turn it? I'm going to snap that. We got to go. I lost 10 bucks. 10 dollar clip. Thanks. Yeah, 10 bucks. At least we got Simba. Wait, that's not Simba. Uh, what, what is it? What is it? Nala. Nala. Yo, I can't wait to roll up to the Tesla meets, dude. Nah, uh, full star. Hell yeah, dude. Look at all the Teslas. Volvo full star is better. Once the M2 is paid off, and yes, I still have it. It's just in Florida. We're trying to get all this stuff out, and I'm just going to fly and drive the M2 back. But once that M2 is done, we get a Tesla. I don't even care. 
Imagine if I stood it on him. <laughs> It'd be kind of funny. Do a fucking burnout. Right? No. Man, this kind of sucks because I feel like I just got here. But we already have to leave to go back to Florida. This is as far as we got the office. We would have finished this the day before yesterday, but three boxes only did this and this was 210 bucks so i just got three more boxes today we were going around the other day looking everywhere lowe's home depot everywhere was sold out to the point where we just had to order it and we were able to pick it up in the store this morning so that's there but to be honest i kind of want to worry about what i have to do today in order to leave and all of that stuff you guys know hurricane ian he gave me this s14 for free which is actually insane and it turns out that tommy mr f yeah himself he built huracan ian this rx7 or refreshed this rx7 for him and it's it's been done for a while now they just never got it transported or anything so i think what i'm gonna do today is we're gonna load this thing up and we're gonna deliver this to ian himself and go back to ohio <laughs> It's a little out of the way, but it's the least I can do. I know he's gonna be super stoked to get his FD and stuff. They're just going through it one last time, charging the battery, making sure everything is good. And then we're gonna throw that on the trailer. But before we do any of that, I don't wanna leave without the blueberry just sitting here having to be pushed around and stuff. So I had to sell the ECU out of this car a while ago and ordered an ECU a while ago and it actually just came in last week. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna put an ECU in this thing, drive it around real quick make sure everything is good and then we're gonna park that thing away um this thing's actually gonna be getting a new engine very soon i wanted to do it a lot sooner rather than later but with this move and trying to plan everything it's just been one hell of a nightmare you guys are gonna find out what's going in that very shortly when we get back to florida it's just rush 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 and now i have a hurt ankle fuck let's get the blueberry together all right guys well I just reflashed um, the tune onto the Blueberry. She's running good. The only thing bad about this car and the reason why I just never really um, used it is because it needs an entire new head. Like the valves on this thing is just so bad that every time you drive it, it just blows oil out of the exhaust. Like literally blue clouds and you're about to see that in a second. To be honest, I've never even done anything with this. So I think I'm gonna do a little donut. I don't think Tommy minds, right? Uh, he doesn't mind. He doesn't mind because he does it every day. Yeah. So as long as I don't hit anything, it's fine. If I hit something, then obviously there's a problem for sure. I don't even know if this is an open diff. It's a, it's probably a viscous because it's a 1.6, but it should do something. I mean, regardless, we're getting a new engine in this and stuff, and I already have someone that wants the ITB, so this engine, it's not really that big of a deal. Like, the engine's fine. It's just the valve seals, it's just... It's not good. It just blows right by. You can't drive this on the road because literally you'll be driving and then randomly this thing will just start smoking like a chimney. So to each their own. Um, you guys are going to find out, like I said, what we're going to be putting in this. But you want to do the honors here? I'm not going to go anything crazy because Tom will probably scream at me, right? A little crazy. Ben says it's okay, Tom. It's okay. <laughs> Dude, I've never drifted so stancy before. I think I have actually. This thing is nice. <laughs> Two that thumbs. was two, two thumbs, thumbs up, huh? One thumb. The engine didn't really smoke too bad. Uh, or was yeah. it the tires? I mean, it's going pretty good right now. hibernation until we're ready for that engine swap which I mean this is probably gonna be the first one of the first builds that I do right when I come back to Connecticut just because I made a mistake and you guys gonna find out anyways I mean most of you probably already know but we'll just talk about it later but this thing she's a drifter I mean I don't, I don't want to drift this car it's super clean it's I love the way it sits and everything but like that was fun I was sick actually was that sick nice. it slid too easy very clean. Too it. easy. It, but we're gonna put her away and um, continue to pack. This thing is so beautiful. I think this is the first time I'm ever driving an FD before and I'm just driving it into a trailer. Ugh. All right. 
Hell yeah, this thing is sick. Sick. Can you believe these things are like what 50k right now? They're a lot of money. And this thing is like immaculate. Yeah. No. Damn, man. So I'm just stoked that I can do this for Ian because he gave me that 240. I didn't even tell him that I'm actually doing this. <laughs> I'm just gonna be like, yo, I got your car, man. What the S14? Nah, you're FD. <laughs> so I'm gonna strap this thing down, make sure it's extra safe, and um, we're almost kind of ready to leave. I just want to vent on how annoying things are and how like complicated stupid things are gonna are always for this channel here all right so first we we got a ball thief in florida all right i've gotten two of my hitches stolen one two inch one two and five sixteenths one off the truck one off this truck and um i needed another ball so i decided that i was gonna get something like this because since the colorado is so low the trailers are always sitting like this and it's just not good so i decided to get something that was good at first i didn't like this idea because i thought like obviously this is a drop hitch and i didn't know if you were supposed to be doing it like this but on the directions it literally tells you that you can do either way as a rise hitch or a drop hitch so i'm like oh sick like thought i was being smart and everything i used the wrench in the store i'm like save myself 10 bucks this is great look at this ready so there's two holes here right this is the right hole for that <laughs> tell me the problem here oh 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 wait a minute it doesn't fucking fit ah <sighs> this would literally sit so perfect too i'm so annoyed man dang it dude it literally won't even fit in that hole either god fuck now i gotta return all of this because i don't want to drill this out because you don't want this any further because obviously we're going to be towing with a load on the way back to connecticut and everything it's just it's just not safe and you don't want anything to bend it's, dude it's so close literally needs a fucking cut hair unbelievable i'm so upset didn't bring my gopro in so i'm filming my iphone <laughs> this is what i'm doing right now we're just gonna get one of these again i mean it's it works it just i wanted it to be a little safer but i guess we don't really have an option at least this one works we know it works Ooh, this is hard to do while filming there we go come on keep going keep going charlie <sighs> now we crank this b down i get this thing on there come on here we go <sighs> <sighs> That's 
tight as fuck. All right, so we got that one. Put this tool back. The next guy that needs to use it. Time to return this thing. Dang it. Ah, well, whoever's stealing my hitches, fuck you. We smartened up. We got a lock on this thing now, so get at me. It's not the tallest thing in the world, but I guess it'll do. All right, well, the Rado is all loaded up with an empty trailer, so we can bring all my stuff from Florida. We got this one. We also got the big one. Obviously, the FD is in there right now, but... You ready for this, dude? All over again. Ohio. You have more miles on this truck than I do. How does that make you feel? Not great, because they're it's, not good miles. Dude, it's... I mean, it's hard in my truck. I couldn't imagine in the Rado. It's probably loud. I mean, I'm sure, like, the first couple hours, it's not too bad, but... When you're getting up in the tens. Oh, I have the music blasting and blowing out the speakers. So. Oh, well, I'll just replace the speakers. But I think we're gonna end the video right here, guys. Um, it was a lot of packing, a lot of bull crap, but we have to, it's already seven o'clock and we have to drive to Ohio tonight. I actually ended up calling Ian and just telling him that we're coming because I wanna, I wanna make sure that he's there and I wanna make sure that he's actually even all right with me towing it and stuff. I didn't wanna just throw his car in the trailer and be like, yo dude, and he'd be upset about it. But he's cool, he's excited. And um, I'm excited to drive that Huracan. So if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys want to subscribe for more, subscribe for more. We have 1,900 uh, miles ahead of us. And I'm already exhausted. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Or maybe the next day. Peace.